We had him throw basically two innings in the bullpen uh, down underneath the cage to keep him going, and then we knew he had about 10 or 15 pitches, and then we decided to take him out after he gave up a couple hits. He just didn't look quite as sharp. Uh, Tyler went through the seventh, and then uh, or six, and then in the seventh, he uh, got the first out on the first pitch. Were you thinking after he walked those two batters, were you ever thinking of taking him out after that? No, I mean, I just, you know, our bullpen was short again today. Um, I really didn't want to use Green. I didn't want to use um, Adam. I really didn't want to use Sessa. <laughs> so, you know, I, you know, we needed some multiple innings. And, you know, you get in a rain delay, and usually Montgomery's going to give you more. It's just kind of the nature of what happened tonight. You brought up Sessa his last two outings. Now he's been pretty good. Yeah. What are your thoughts on him? Yeah, I mean, he's done a good job out of the bullpen. So, obviously, you know, he's done his job when he's come in and helped us out. Eric. Well, your bullpen's given up a lot of food. In this yeah. Bullpen. How devastating for a team can that be when, you know, maybe not night after night, but you, you yeah. sustain as many of these as you have it's, part it, of the season? It's difficult because it seems like we've had a hard time getting them lined up the way we want just because of need. Um, we've had to use guys in situations we didn't necessarily want to use them, but because of need, we haven't been able to line them up kind of the way that you would usually do it. Um, and we and, and we got to get it. We got to get it right. We got to get guys back on track. Guys that are extremely important to us. You know, the, when you talk about the back end of your bullpen, those guys are as important as anyone, and we got to get them back on track. And it's been a struggle. George, right behind you, Mike. Joe, how disappointing is lose a game when the other team made five errors in the yeah. four innings? Yeah, I mean, it's really disappointing. But we didn't have many hits, you know. So, I mean, they gave us some opportunities through their errors, and we scored some runs. But we didn't have a lot of hits tonight. You know, if you put some walks and some hits with those five errors, you can put up a pretty big number, but we weren't able to. Andrew. Aaron passed uh, Joe DiMaggio yeah. on the home run list. Uh, what do you think about that? Pretty special. I mean, that's a pretty special name he passed. Um, it's really incredible what he's done um, in the first half of this season. You talk about, you know, you talk about the home runs, but the runs, the walks, the average he's hit for, the defense that he's played. Um, it's been a pretty special first half. Roger. Joe, did you think that Clifford had straightened something out? I mean, the, the three previous appearances yeah. he hadn't allowed a run. Yeah, we felt that he had gotten back on track. Um, and today what really hurt us in this game were the walks. Uh, again, the walks are what really hurt us today, um, giving them extra base runners and creating situations. And it's kind of been what's hurt us the last few days. Um, and you can't, you can't give extra base runners because hitters are extremely dangerous. And when you do, you give up big numbers. Do you, do you see something in, in the way that Clifford is pitching right now that maybe indicates to you why this is going on? Well, um, you know, he did a pretty good job the first thing, he got the first out, and, th and then, you know, for me it was the bad counts that he got into is, is what hurt him. And earlier, you know, his fastball wasn't high enough. You know, he pitches up with his fastball, we all know that. And his changeup wasn't low enough, and that was getting him in trouble as well. Is his, is his confidence in – in a place that yeah, I mean, it's not where you want it because, you know, he struggled. Um, and I think that's pretty normal for any player when you struggle, whether you're in a slump. You, um, you know, there's frustration there. And, you know, Clip has, you know, Clip has been through this before, and I believe he will, you know, come out of it and be fine. Um, but when you're going through hard times, of course you're going to question things that you do. It's just only normal. Eric. You said Montgomery after the uh – the delay wasn't as sharp. What did you think of him before the rain delay? I thought he was pretty good. Uh, he made a mistake with one slider tonight. Um, but I, overall, I thought he was pretty good tonight.